Oh, hey guys, it's pretty late on this vapey Saturday evening. Yep, been cranking on this, uh, my IPv2, which I have plugged in right now because I killed the battery. But I've been cranking on this beast. Seven watts still, because that's about as all I can take. Uh, tonight Rex and I went over to a buddy's birthday party. Went over there for around, well we went for coffee at 7. Frigged off over there for around 8.30. Left there at around 10. And, uh... All I've been doing all day, I didn't do anything today. Today was a fucking lazy day for me. I played the shit out of some video games. Uh, I've been playing Bully. I'm rendering up the footage now. I uh, got about, uh, I'd say, four hours of footage to sift through. So we'll shit out a bunch of series in that. So that's my next Let's Play is Bully, the scholarship edition on Steam. It's 4x3 because I didn't realize until later that uh, this game supports widescreen now. Whoops. So I fixed that and turned anti-aliasing on and all that shit. So now it looks a lot nicer. But uh, like last night I was in bed by around, I'd say 12.30. I was passed out. And then uh, today I woke up at about 7.30 in the morning. Because I can only sleep, for some, for some reason I can only sleep for like 6 hours. It's pretty dick. Woke up and I started doing laundries. Because I realized all I had left for clean clothing was this white vlogging life shirt. And uh, these fucking faded black pants that I'm wearing right now. I was like, oh dick, I need laundry. So I've been doing laundry like crazy all day and just banging out load after load, trying to get all my laundry done. And then I need to do some work upstairs to figure some shit out. So as you can tell, this is still going. This is still going. Need to bring this shit upstairs and put it away, but whatever, I'll wait till this is done. It's probably almost done. I can't tell where the needle is. Yeah, it's got like maybe 15 minutes left in the cycle. Not a big deal, not a big deal. So 15 minutes, that'll be done, and I'll get my that done, and I'll bring that shit upstairs. Um, but uh, I was looking at over this, looking at over this, really, Adam? That's not even fucking English. But I'm thinking about bringing this thing upstairs, because it's got a lot of technology and stuff in it, like video games and keyboards and all sorts of shit. So I was going to bring that upstairs and put it in the corner. How the fuck did that fall over? My oil heater, stupid cat. Um, I'm thinking about hooking up my Sony my Sony surround sound. I currently have it sitting in the cupboard, just not hooked up. And I was thinking about hooking it back up because I have all the speakers and all the wires for it and shit. So I was going to hook it back up and then have some decent sound down here. So that's awesome. I've been riding the fuck out of this poor thing, but I need to buy some cheap tennis shoes because I've been wearing my, uh, well, the only shoes I have that are good. Either the swamp shoes that I use for running the uh, mini bikes or I've been using my good high top boots because running this thing barefoot sucks because your feet get like pinched up against the wall there and it crushes them and it really hurts after a while. But uh, what I like about this is as you're going, it has like your warm up and then your fat burn zone, which is where I like to stay, and then endurance and then performance. Now, what you're supposed to do is you get her into performance and you hold her there till your heart beats pretty high and then you bring her back down to fat burn and you hold her there until your heartbeat goes low again and then you bounce and that's called high interval intensity training or something like that intense training or i i don't know it's h double i t and it's great for burning fat so like if you do that for like an hour for the next four hours your body remains hot and you just burn off the fucking fat it's awesome but um yeah they got all sorts of different programs see like they have the high intensity training right there the resistance pace and uh, all that shit so you can get your heart rate to bounce around like a son of a bitch and all that like they got all the different programs and stuff you can do and i just haven't bothered but uh fucking sweet so like i said rex and i went over to this party it was my buddy uh, craig's birthday today birthday party today so we went over there and hung out for a couple hours but it wasn't like before we used to go over there <laughs> before we used to go over there and it was like we knew everybody everybody we knew this time we walked in there and like the only people we really knew were like Craig and his girlfriend and a couple other people like very minimalistic other people so it was kind of dicked but it was alright it was still pretty fun hung around for a couple of hours chatted with people and uh, decided to call her a night because I think Rex works in the morning and tomorrow if it's nice I'm going to try and talk Adrian into going for a rip on the minis because uh, I'm fucking due for a romp I'm like majorly due for a romp and I think he's off tomorrow and I don't know if he's going fishing or not that's what he did last Sunday was he went fishing so he might do that again I don't know I don't friggin know but um yeah, other than that, it's been a pretty simple day, people. Just keeping her easy. I was supposed to do that fucking baseboard, but depending on what happens tomorrow, if Adrian wants to go for a romp or not, if he doesn't want to go for a romp and he's going fishing, then I might go ahead and uh, do something about this baseboard because uh, the wall doesn't come down to the floor like the, the support beams in the back do, but the wall was obviously put up by an imbecile. So I'm going to fix that tomorrow. I'm just going to 
grab some of that flat stock in the garage and nail it right to the goddamn wall and that'll stop that from, from being spread apart. And I'm going to do it back here too. I'm going to do it all around because um, last night when I came home from work, I walk in the house and I hear chirp like a real lot of fucking chirp that came from this room. Well, silly scampers had a chippy pinned down over here behind the wood, behind the, uh, the, the pipes, the ducting there. And the thing couldn't get out and she couldn't get to him. So it was chirping away and then it ran out and it ran back behind here. So she went after it, but she couldn't get to it because it got into a, a secure location. And I ended up uh, going in the other room and grabbing my pellet gun, loading around into it. And I was able to take the little fucker out. So friggin' sapped him right in the head. Pretty much point blank too, it was pretty fucked. So I wasn't gonna tape that. I probably shouldn't even have talked about that because it's kind of rude, but you know, I don't mind rodents outside. They can fucking do what they want. I won't start picking off squirrels outside, but when they come into my house, you know what, there's a lot of wiring in here they can chew and just fuck right up. A lot of stuff they can damage, so. Check out that position. Oh fuck, she's done. <laughs> she was right contorted licking herself. And if I could do that too, I'd never leave the house. Right, buddy? Oh fuck, you got things. But um, yeah, so that was fucking crazy. So like chipmunks, or not chipmunks, but squirrels, no. Chipmunks, little brown and brown ones, little fuckers there. That's what got in a chippy, not a squirrel. Squirrels are too fat. But if a squirrel got in here, oh my goodness, there'd be fucking hell happening. But uh, I want to seal that off before any other foreign creatures decide to get in here. Last thing I need is a fucking snake in the house. I'd lose my shit. Sounds like laundry's done. Oh, the washer's done. Perfect. Got another load to dry. As soon as this load's done drying, it should be awesome. But I'd better get back upstairs and check on those bully renders because I want to get those done and over with and get them deployed. Because I'm thinking once I'm laid off, I'm going to be running scaven games like pretty hardcore. Like I want to do minimum two a day on there, maximum four a day, depending on what I'm doing. And I want to start playing different games too. Like I want to try, I want to get back into uh, spin tires. I want to get back into that one. And I want to get into uh, BM, uh, Beam MG, I think it's called. Beam NG, sorry. Uh, the next car game. I have that one too, and I haven't been playing it. Like, I got a lot of new games that came with Humble Bundle Packs, and I haven't even bothered touching them yet, and they're not too bad. So, got a lot of games I want to try out and fucking film and put up on YouTubes. So, let's get cranking. Holy fuck, boys. Oh, I've just been editing videos and running laundry all night. Holy fuck, do I ever got to use it. Right back. Fuck, I almost didn't make it. But, uh, this is like my third or seventh load of laundry. So, let's get that taken out and swap it out. Still got a lot more laundry to do. See, I'm kind of lazy. And, uh, when I come downstairs to shower, I tend to just fire my laundry behind the door in the bathroom. I should get a hamper system in there or something. And when it's full, I roll laundry, right? That's how I should do it, but I'm not doing it that way because I'm stupid up here sometimes. But, uh, that's fine. So tomorrow, I have no idea what's going on. I'm just going to roll with it. Probably fire off a vlog and I'll let you guys know what's happening tomorrow. Tomorrow, because I don't even know. One thing I know I need to do one of these days. I'm going to show you guys. This, this is one of, my, one of my swords from back in the day. It's a katana. It's a uh, katana here, but you notice how it doesn't sheath completely. It's because if you take a look at the sheath, you'll notice it's bent up. Yeah. She's fucking hangled. So I need to figure out a way to straighten this, and I got an idea, and it sounds pretty stupid, but I'm going to run it by you guys before I do it, in case uh, there might be a flaw. Basically what I'm thinking about doing is taking two pieces of like 2x4 or something, putting it between the scabbard, and then getting that between my vise, and just fucking cranking her tight. You know, not enough to crush the scabbard, but enough to make it go straight and then leaving it there for a while, like a fucking week or something, and seeing if it'll form. Now, I don't know if I'm gonna need moisture to do it, if I'm gonna need to steam it. I don't know, I've never straightened wood before. And when I tried to look it up online on how to straighten wood, all I saw was use a planer. So I was like, yeah, I'm not about to plane the scabbard because that ain't gonna do shit. The whole inner core fucking turns. So you can't have that, the sword won't go in. And I want to fix that up because that's a fucking sweet blade. And uh, one of the things I want to do one of these days whenever I get the time and money to do it, that's the main thing, the money. Oh fuck, my router shit the bed again. Um, but uh, I want to build that wall back there. I want to block off those, those things there. And I want to build a shelf and then I want to make it like a display cabinet with some pot lights to uh, show my swords off, my little sword collection. I think that'll look fucking awesome over there. 
do some cleanup and throw some shit in the garbage and the fuck is that thing doing, eh? Look at her laser eyeballs. God, she's dicked. But uh, that's what I was thinking about doing was building that all up and then uh, fucking have the swords on display over there, have the 75 bend pipe fixed so there's not as many bends, have that hidden behind a bulkhead and have a little display cabinet and I'd relocate that camera obviously probably move it over to the other side or over on this wall somewhere aiming downwind I don't know but uh, frig yeah I think that's pretty sweet and you know what these cameras only started acting up when I started using that fucking server program I bet just this computer here doing it I'm gonna disable that server program reboot the router and see if that fixes it son of a bitch do you think he wants to cuddle with me? You fucking think he wants to cuddle with me? Oh my goodness. Look at him. He's just trying so fucking hard to attack me. Oh my goodness. What's the matter for you? Boop. Nope. No, away with you. Away with you. No. 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 Away. No. Away. 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 Look at him. Look at him. He's like, Help. Help. Like a fish out of the water. You're so stuffy. Oh, God. I, I can't. But anyway, I gotta turn off the stupid server program. It's fucked. Alright, I just disabled the iSpy server down here. Why is fucking anti shock turned off again? Son of a bitch. But there we go. That's better. Fuck, I must have been shaky a while ago, eh, when I was filming this friggin' thing. Oh my goodness, do you want to fight me again? Oh, I got your face. Oh, I got your face. What are you gonna do? You can't do anything. You're just a stupid puppy. Oh, so stupid. Oh, puppy. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Yeah, I didn't think so. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do about it? How much drool I have in my hand from this fucking thing now? Jesus. He wants to bite me so bad. Hey, buddy, he just wanna bite me so bad. You're gonna fall off the couch. We're gonna lose campers coming in trying to get involved. He's fucking popper. He's a puppy dog. And he's really stupid. Skeetle doodle do, skeetle doodle do, skeetle doodle do do. He's stupid puppy. He's a bit puppy. He's a stupid dog. He's really dumb, but he's fucking fluffy. Puppy dog, little douche. But anyway, people, that's all the time I have for tonight. I need to wash my hands because they smell like my dog's face, which smells like his bum. And uh, I'm going to bed. So I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Sorry for the two inform informative vlogs. Informative vlogs, you know. But uh, I haven't been really doing much. The stuff I have been doing hasn't been awesome for YouTube. So, you know, just been fucking doing things. So. That's the way she goes. Fuck the dogs out of water. So is the cat too. Better reload that, son of a bitch. But I'm gonna shut this down anyway, people. I'm gonna call her quits for now and carry on tomorrow. So hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, click the like button. Questions, comments, concerns. And until next time, people, keep on vlogging.